So how do we get into the first section entry? It's quite simple, as long as you've trained your forms and your Hunsells correctly, and you can find the Hunsell video in the description below, then with my left arm, I rotate Hunsell control grab with the thumb, not without the thumb. So I rotate the left hand here, grab, boom. And I do this whilst he's moving his arm. So he's encouraging his, my hand around. He's encouraging it around, not you go like this and then you grab, yeah? Not here, grab. It's a one continuous motion, one continuous motion, one continuous motion. So that's the right arm, low elbow, grabbing control, high elbow, and come underneath and tap my ribs, no good, yeah? So control here, control here. And then with the other hand, I simply shift my foot, right hand, controls here. Both elbows are very low, not up like this. You get hit underneath very easily. I take control, my legs are linked in with my elbows, so they're very, very strong. And shift, boom. So notice what I'm not doing is this, and pulling him like this, because guess what? If you pull someone towards you, guess what they're gonna do? They're gonna attack you. It's gonna hurt a lot, that elbow, yeah? So we don't want to do that. We want to take control of his body and his arms by shifting it away from me like this. So now I've got a really nice angle to then generate this next attack. I mean, you might not even, you might not even get to the first section. You might just need to do this entry and do the attack. If someone hasn't got any uh, forward energy or pressure, then all you're going to have to do is just to move their arm to hit them. Very simple, but when Chief is in and we do it properly, he has got a lot of pressure. Now I can't, I can't get to him here because he's, he's forcing his arms into me. This is why we need to remove his arms in the first place, but to get them off of his sense line so I can then attack. But now you can see I can't attack him over here because his arms are pushing towards me and they're going to react if I do that. But with someone with no, with someone with no pressure, of course, you know, just boom, and then I can hit them. There's nothing. So one more time you see it like that again, I just angle and hit them. Very simple. But this is for someone, again, who trains it with no forward pressure, no energy. And yes, there are times when we do train it just to learn the shapes and the positions. Um, but when you learn that, you should be training with a lot more energy. So let's, uh, let's demonstrate one more time. So here, here. So notice I am not pulling his arms this way, I'm definitely not pulling his arms outwards like this because he's going to hit me. There's no reason to do that. Yeah, I just take his arms away from his body and then shift my foot so I can then do the next part of Chisa section one.